so I got the La Bouton dupes from Zara. It's a pity Levi's didn't actually invite thick girls to their thick jeans launch because Welcome to my channel. If you're a returning subscriber, welcome back. And if you are a new subscriber, hi, my name is Wanda. Hi, my name is Wanda underscore V, and my face is dry, so I need to apply my face. I just wanted to do it with you guys because I've been complaining about my skin so much, and I finally uh, feel like I have a solution. I'm, I went back to using my day one regular diggalish regular moisturizer one thing about me as much as i'm keen to um what do you call it try out new products i also keep my stash of products that i know will always save me if i'm having an emergency with my skin and this is one of them so I'm using that and I also exfoliated my skin with the Afriderm exfoliator guys I don't know if I've mentioned I've ever mentioned this that exfoliator I never used that one in specific I was using ugh, I don't even know what the brand is but you remember back in the days like people there were people that used to stand like at the mall and they would like sell us these like so-called Dead Sea products. Those those products. Um, my stepmom fell for that. I don't know if it's a scam or whatever. But she kind of fell for those people. And she bought products. And one of them was the peeling. That gentle exfoliating peel. And when I tell you the day I started using that peel. The issues I had with my skin. With my skin being scaly and always having like dead skin just sitting on top of my skin evaporated like the the day i started using that peel my skin just became what it is now so uh, i don't use it all the time but like as i mentioned i had a rash and it kind of left my skin scaly because the the bumps went away and my face was just like feeling very rough and weird so i used that uh what you call it that exfoliator for that and it literally was the best 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 thing that has ever happened to my skin but anyway guys my my morning was very really, not hectic but like 
I was very focused on working in the morning. So I did a lot of working. I also went for a cute hot girl walk. Because as I, as I said, I'm taking a break from the gym, guys. I'll go back there. But I'm going to go back. Uh, so I was taking a little hot girl wash. I'm um, sorry. A little hot girl walk. My hair is super frizzy. So we're going to use... I want freebie. <laughs> Guys, I actually have to go pick up my kids. It's, it's not late, but like, I kind of prefer picking them up like on the early side. So I need to rush, but I just wanted to give you a little rundown on my skin. Also, in that new Mitchum, that Mitchum that I showed you guys, it is natural has zero aluminium uh if you if you that girl and you like like you know the natural stuff try it out i love it so much i don't even have a reason why i'm using it i mean i have a reason i mean the less chemicals i put in my body the better but if you really are serious about that and it's like your thing I really think you should check it out like it actually smells divine I also found a hundred percent natural cotton tampons from Woolies I'll show you guys uh, throughout the week but yeah I also feel like since like summer is Ring, this is the best time for me to use my favorite I love this fragrance so much I love I love it love it so much this is literally one of my favorite fragrances especially for the summer it's the Jo Malone English Pear and Freesia so so good guys i'm back home and my veggies are boiling is this the right mm. <laughs> and i'm about to season my salmon and i'm gonna have this with rice but i don't want to eat this late but yeah whatever Dugons are the most dangerous creatures in the world. One thing about me, I'm a burn my salmon, guys. It's about Google. My salmon is burned, but I know it's delicious. Anyway, guys, I'm going to go eat and catch up on some YouTube or Netflix or something. See you guys tomorrow.
I feel like I should put foundation here, but I actually hate it when I can see people's foundation. Um, I don't know how I feel about that. But anyway, like, it will get better, guys. One thing about me, I don't want to stress myself. Anyway, I don't know if I should open this package from Zara, because I'm so excited. I'm actually super, super excited. But let's open the other things, actually. Ugh. The lighting is weird today. We are, like, the sun is crazy. Let me just prep you guys up a little bit. I actually bought a few things from Zara that are downstairs and I, I don't want to fetch them. I'm tired. But I got a blazer, a black blazer. That's how I'm saying I'm done buying capsule wardrobe stuff. I bought a black blazer, some gray skinnies that I've had for a long time, but uh, those ones were old and didn't fit. And also, I just, I didn't want the skinnies. I wanted that color, but not in the skinny. I wanted it in like a mom jean. But guys, I don't know what's going on at H&M. Can someone please explain? I'm asking so nicely because H&M one day, like the stuff can fit me. Today, they don't. H&M, that's not good for my self-esteem. Honestly, it's, it's just not healthy. But anyway, let me show you the things that are close to me that I got. And these are things that I've accumulated throughout the month because even the stuff that I bought at Poetry was meant to be a dress that I was supposed to wear on my birthday because I don't know why. Did I think it's going to be hot on my birthday? But anyway, um, let's check Zara. So I got these these on sale the zara sale was still on exactly these things are quite old i got these at zara because believe it or not guys i really want to create bobby content but you guys are tired like i want to wear my clothes uh, but i just got these because i feel like they're so pretty and uh metallic is on trend and i feel like since i don't have money like that to spend on expensive things a pair of czar heels that are on sale will definitely work in my favor regarding that trend and also like oh i think because i had this chat with mali but i really want to start doing fashion content like specifically fashion content i'm just going through that guys uh just let me know if you would appreciate it like tell you which trends um because i wanted to do um which trends I'm going to be including in my wardrobe, um, 2023 trends that I'm going to be including in my wardrobe. But yeah, these are super cute. Uh, I will fit them on for you guys. And then I got one other shoe. Ah! This I need to share with my TikTok people. But anyway, guys, uh, all my fashion girlies have this one la bouton uh heel that i thought was stinking cute i saw it on one of my favorite girlies she had one in painted yellow and i was like you know what whatever color because initially she bought a black but then she returned it and got the yellow I, I don't know i think it was the other way around but anyway so i got the la bouton dupes from zara um uh, i got the it's the what's the style hello dolly hello dolly i think it's like named after dolly parton but it's this cute i know it looks ugly but oh the way i'm gonna abuse these shoes in summer ah stunning and also mommy friendly one thing about me i'm not buying shoes that are not mommy friendly these are so cute i'm gonna start linking things down below for just you know to help everyone um yeah but these are stinking cute can't wait guys i genuinely can't wait when i fitted them on i still had a french on my toes and oh oh these were i know they look like nothing but honestly they are something they are so cute and i'm gonna style them so many in so many ways uh also the the leather is actually looks like proper leather but they they're quite good ah 
obsessed can't wait guys this is i don't know i'm so happy about these shoes uh and and then zara snapped zara snapped this i'm telling you this month zara was doing the thing oh my god zara love you get all look what i got guys i showed you this on my vlog Prepare to be sick of me. Prepare to be sick of me. And from now on, actually, even on my Instagram, I am going to post, even if I take pictures with my phone, get ready to post that. Like, I feel like there's just so many restrictions that are not allowing me to be great. And I don't care if I took the picture with my phone or with what. I'm just going to post it. If I feel like it's cute, I'm just going to post it. And it, even if it doesn't fit my eye, I post it. I'm just doing. But anyway, gonna fit this card. White. And if you want to know what size I got them in, I got it in a large. It goes up to 2XL, actually. Yes, it goes up to XXL, which is 2XL. Uh, but I got it in the large and it in scrum I could have, no, I would be doing too much with a medium. But like the top is quite like almost loose. But nothing that I can't fix, honestly. It's a pity Levi's didn't actually invite thick girls to their thick jeans launch because... Uh, and then I went to Cotton On because initially I wanted to wear this to the Clicks Beauty... What is it called? Clicks Beauty Playground. And uh, I changed my mind at a later stage. But basically this is the skirt that everyone has uh but this is in this wash kim bought a lighter wash guys and it she wore it on on her on a reel and scrummed liam she looked strong i took a 16 in this one i don't even remember what what size i took in that other one and then uh for shini guys i keep on saying that for shini for shini's eating gang man, gang man. and i think the reason why i started going into Foshini's because when I was shooting that raid show most of the stuff that the stylist sourced were from Foshini and um, I was just like oh things are cute at Foshini then I found those shoes when I was with my sister and my sister loves Foshini like she's always just like let's go into Foshini so the reason why I got into Foshini this time because she was buying stuff because she was starting her new job and she was just purchasing stuff and then I've been looking for a pair of black slags for the longest time. And when I tell you that these are literally almost half the price for the ones from the one from Zara, but the ones from Zara are very dressy. Like you can't dress them down. Does that make sense? Like they're very formal, like all, almost office wear, the ones from Zara. But these ones, baby, like these are a bit like, you know flowy so you can either dress them up or down and i got them in a 16 i was hoping to get an 18 because i kind of wanted the loose loose fit and just tied on my waist but i can go with the 16 i still have to tailor it but eat sweetie scrumdly yum then for all my girls who are still like scrambling to get their capsule wardrobe i found gems at poetry you guys know i love poetry if you ever wanted to buy me something buy me a gift card or something from poetry um but yeah so i went into poetry and they were having a sale what else did i buy poetry? oh one thing about me this month was a good month when i tell you i got another gem at poetry oh oh my god but basically you see if you want to upgrade from those like zara she in bodysuits and you want something that is more serious and something that you can wear a bra with i got these from poetry they had like a special and i got three colors um stunning also the quality guys i have one that's like big show vibes like the one that is one hand 
and I always said that the quality of their sh their t-shirts is out of this world and these are so good I got one in nude white and one in black that's why I'm saying Giri, my capsule wardrobe I'm not going to do it anymore. But these, good. And then, guys, you remember I had that long skirt that I tried on from Poetry that um, was supposed to be like basically a maxi. Like, I've been seeing this outfit on Pinterest where this lady's like wearing a long maxi black silky skirt and that outfit eats and i was just like that other skirt that i got was long but it was not long enough like it wasn't giving what i needed it to give uh then i got this one from poetry it was also on sale ah i'm having such a i'm having a time of my life when i say time of my life wrinkled I gave that other one to my sister and I got this is extra long when I say extra long it is extra long you remember how I was wearing you know how I was wearing my other dress from poetry that I got for their event uh, as a what you call it as as a skirt this was literally perfect it the start of the show is D die rock. I was gonna wear this on my birthday because I kind of wanted to give garden party. Oh, this oh, this is from Poetry New Spring Summer Collection. Scrum dilly, scrum dilly, my love, scrum dilly. I'm back to being mei from pang. How gorgeous is this? Dresses like these make me feel so grown like <laughs> i literally feel like oh but this is so nice this from poetry my loves i feel so grown oh december not ready for summer guys now i'm ready for summer i'm back from picking up the boys and I'm exhausted. I have so many things to do, guys. I actually have work. I need to edit sponsored videos. Like, mommy, what's the spreadsheet? How was the? Anyway, I'm having these pop stickers for lunch. Um, it's six of them. I had, I had six yesterday. Six yesterday. Please go. <laughs> I had six yesterday and I burnt myself like crazy. Like my mouth is injured. Okay. Take a plate. Take a plate. My mouth is injured, guys. Literally injured. Uh, but they are so good because they were so hot and I was so hungry and I was. And it also comes with the sauce. I had half of the sauce. It's like a sesame seed and soy sauce sauce. It's hot it at first it didn't taste hot but it's actually really hot please take a plate oh guys so these have been holding me down thank you to snow Vuyo for putting us on sd country guys because these are like rice cakes turn into chips like turn into doritos yeah like for me they're, they're good though and i like this sweet chili flavor scrum dilly I actually have a lot of things to do. I have to go to Postnet, which is closing at five. I have to come back and work, guys. Oh! Love this. 
I love you so much. Mm. When God made earth, he said also Woody's food must be there because guys, actually I'm not that person. Like I don't I don't care for the hype of Woolies, if that makes sense. The same way a lot of people care about it. But they know how to make something. That's one thing for sure. And I think that's why a lot of people shop there. Also people who want to like who love having access to like specialty things. I think Woolies is really good for that. But oh my god, they always like they never they hardly miss. Honestly, they hardly miss. I don't wanna lie. Mm. Veggies done steaming. Salmon ready to cook. No, this is not salmon actually. This is trout. Guys, when I tell you I got home, I'll poke, I know. I'm literally drinking tea. I'm drinking the lemon peel and ginger root. Got home and I literally faced the pots because I am starving. My veggies are so soggy. But anyway, I'm gonna eat. I'm hungry. And I think it's because I put the green beans in the freezer because I was trying to save them. I didn't want to throw them away. And I think that's catching up with me. But anyway, sure. Yeah. I don't know if you had to or what. I don't know. I honestly don't know. And I don't need any off. Do you understand? <laughs> I'm just gonna finish making my food. Oh, these veggies are annoying me so much. I can't really do the shape. Um, then I'm gonna go eat and do some work in the bed because. Good morning, my loves. Hope you guys are doing good. Um, I'm off to a kiddies party, guys. I have been off the vlog for, I think, three days. As you can hear, I'm literally wheezing Gia Gula. But I just want to take my kids out because I didn't take them to school on Friday because Bengi Goa. I don't know why I keep on getting like flu that's off and on, off and on, off and on. It's annoying me, that thing. Honestly, it's really annoying me. But I'm taking my kids off to the party. I'm taking my kids to a party. And I don't know what we're going to do when we come back. Yeah. He's showing us his truck. But anyway, guys, let's go to the party. Ha! I think I'm going to vlog on my phone because the battery of this camera is low. jeans like i'm a proper para like i don't have clothes like i love these jeans so much and they always work but anyway guys i'm back from the party still sick but like i got some sun i guess i'll be better i'm about to eat mochachos guys 
wings. One thing about Bupelo, one thing about life, I know they're going to disappoint me because there is no other better muchachos than the one in Fixburg. But I'm going to have to settle for what I have. I don't know if I'm going to eat this, but I'm just... I'm trying to eat up so that I don't feel the need to eat later. But after here, I'm just going to wind down, take off my wig. I think I'm going to end the vlog. Honestly, I'm so sorry. I've been very sick. I'm sorry. I promise next week I'll try my best. <laughs> but yeah, let me eat my plate of disappointment. And... um watch some mommy club because sana i have so many i have so many feels i have so many things but right now i hope you guys because i'm i'm kind of I'm, I'm like three episodes behind right now love no no right yes Anna. i love a confident messy queen um love her so much i love her so much so let me catch up with